Today we are checking out Scream for the very first time. So I thought as we're going into spooky season, why not check out some horror movies I've never seen before? And Scream being such a massive franchise as it is, I thought why not check this one out to celebrate Halloween. So going into these movies, I think they're kind of campy horror type films. The only thing I do know about these movies is that Jenna Ortega is in them later on down the line and that's practically it. So I'm kind of going blind into this one, but I feel that's the best way to do it. Let's just jump into it and see what it's all about. Scream, jeez, they are screaming. Uh, hello? I'm sorry, I guess I dialed the wrong number. Uh, well, so why'd you dial it again? To apologize. To on edge with the uh, window in the background, like someone standing there. Really building up the tension with these outside shots. It's creepy. Uh, what's this? You tell me your name, I'll tell you mine. <laughs> I don't think so. At some point when you just stop picking up the phone. I thought just some scary movie. You like scary movies? Uh-huh. Uh, I don't know. Rest right next to the knives. Halloween. You know, the one with the guy in the white mask who What was I saying? Why? You want to ask me out on a date? Maybe. Do you have a boyfriend? Mm, no. Getting straight in there. Asking the real questions. Who I'm looking at. I want to know who I'm talking to. That's not what you said. What do you think I... Uh, you better get the dog inside. I gotta go. Wait, I thought we were gonna go out. Uh, nah, I don't think so. Don't hang up on me. What about we stay in? Listen, asshole! No, you listen, you little bitch. You hang up on me again, I'll cut you like a fish, understand? I got extreme pretty quickly. <laughs> More of a game, really. Bloody. I was he the one that plays games? I know with this one horror film person that they're like, oh, you want to play a game? Can you see me? What if he's already in the house? Seconds away from calling the police. They'd never make it in time. We're out in the middle of the <laughs> I'm calling the police. <laughs> just get a weapon, woman. You've had your fun now, so I think you better just leave or else. Yeah, you better just leave. I thought you didn't have a boyfriend. I lied. Huh? I do have a You cheated on him. He's big and he plays football and he'll kick the shit out of you. His name wouldn't be Steve, would it? Not Steve. <laughs> oh, God. How did he set that up so quickly? How is he on the phone ringing the doorbell doing that at the same time? I want to play a game. <laughs> then he dies no. right now. Then answer the question. Same category. <laughs> Didn't know this would be a quiz. Killer in Friday the 13th. Jason! 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 That's the wrong answer. No, it's not. No, it's not. It was Jason. Jason, I saw that movie 20 goddamn times. Then you should know Jason's mother, Mrs. Voorhees, was the original killer. Jason oh. didn't show up at all. No, she doesn't know her movies. She should be killed. <gasps> no bonus question for Steve. What? No. <laughs> answer correctly, you live. Very simple. <laughs> you are, it's a trick question. You're at no doors. You're inside. <laughs> oh, the popcorn. I'll get the frying pan and go bam. <laughs> oh. It's just spooking around. <laughs> They need to stop doing this. Just surprise, turn around and go BAM! <laughs> oh, gosh. He was doing that on purpose. He was looking weird to place it. <laughs> Your daughter's being killed. Notice. Oh no, he took her vocal cords. Casey! She's got to see who it was before she was murdered. Casey! Casey! In fact, they're panicking looking for her and she's being murdered at the same time. Ah! Ah! Oh gosh! That guy works very fast. Ah! It's just me. 
didn't just murder her, then just dip to her house. What's going on in there? Are you okay? Can you knock? I heard screaming. No, you didn't. Now the expo runs all weekend, so I won't be back till Sunday. Oh, close call. Billy, <laughs> it occurred to me that I've never snuck through your bedroom window. Right in. So I thought, why not try? The exorcist was on. Down for any movie ideas. <laughs> Even if the movie's recommended me movie ideas. I climbed my window and we'd have a little raw footage. <laughs> no. Hey, where's that hand going? On top of the clothes. Top of the clothes. See what you do to me? <laughs> you know what my dad will do to you? Murder you. Maybe the dad's the murderer. Maybe he's going to a different place to murder someone. These are all things we've got to consider. You know, I, I appreciate the romantic gesture. About the, uh, the sex stuff. Didn't want it anyway. So Did you settle for a PG-13 relationship? <laughs> we didn't get a C! Creeping out on us there. This is an R rating. Why is this music so intense for a school? Two young teenagers were found brutally murdered. Authorities have yet to issue a statement. Why didn't we be killed? Ripped open from end to end. Becca, she sits next to me in English. Not anymore. Do you think it's school? They don't know. Even worse than. Well, it's bad. Even worse than, well, it's bad? Sydney. It would appear to be your turn. It was Sydney. We knew it. It was her. Uh, Sydney Prescott. Prescott. Oh, it's, um, oh, what's that guy's name? He's from <coughs> Barry, the acting teacher. <laughs> He's so good in that. Leave a comment below if you've watched Barry. It's such a fun show. The police just want to ask you a few questions. You okay? Mm -hmm. I should know like that is a bit Remember your sus. How do you get someone... And you slid him from growing to sternum. Hey. Hey, how does this guy know so much? And are the police aware that you dated the victim? What are you saying? Uh, dated her and hated Steve? Uh, working, thank you. Oh, at the video store? I thought they fired your sorry ass. Twice. <laughs> Yo, I'm gonna gut your ass in a second, kid. Tell me something. Did you really put her liver in the mailbox? What the hell is wrong with these people? <laughs> Better live her alone. <laughs> <laughs> Never alone! <laughs> What was that? <laughs> He's having way too much fun. Wow. What a gorgeous house. Look at that view in the background. She's home alone. Either good for her boyfriend to come over or the murderer or both. Look at that view. It's incredible. I wonder how much that house costs now considering the location but also... That it was the scream house. Only a year ago, Maureen Prescott, wife and mother, was found raped and murdered. Same murderer? Potentially? Oh, is that why she's been a bit off with everyone? Because she's still grieving. I can't be the only one. Look at that house. My God. The views. The sunset. Look, I'm doing a really good job selling this house. Someone should hire me. You know, if you pause it just right, you can see his penis. Whatever, just... <laughs> can you actually? <laughs> Tatum, just get in the car. Oh, Sydney. I love how they throw you off thinking the first call would be him. Or her. I don't know who it is. <laughs> Randy, you gave yourself away. Are you calling from work because Tatum's on her way over? I think the murderer likes scary movies. Maybe it is that guy from that movie store. Maybe that's because I'm not Randy. Oh, I'm Randy Horton, the wrestler. So where are you? Your front porch. I'm in your bed, underneath the covers. Well, I call you bluff. Oh, was, he wasn't expecting that. So where are you? Huh? What am I doing? Hello? Just like your mother. So he was the one that killed her mother also? <laughs> Badass though. That door technique is such a good play. 
Let me just throws the knife. <laughs> what he needed to do was close the door a bit, peek open the other door, and then squeeze by. Right, the killer series. He's gone. Oh, wait, 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 yeah, you're a real pain in the ass. When I say hurry, please interpret that as move your fat tub of lard ass <laughs> now! That's so harsh. I can see why everyone hates her. He sure was a Hilton. He's not registered there. I still can't believe why the father would leave her alone like that after what happened to her mother. She's watching TV. I got bored. I decided to go for a ride. And she happened to ride by Casey Becker's house. Sheriff, I didn't kill anybody. Then why does he keep staring at it like that? <laughs> it doesn't help you in any way. Can you be on? Yeah, go. Hi, Gail Weber. It's just walking through everyone's interview. God damn it, Dewey. Well, what did Mama tell you? When I wear this badge, you treat me like a man of the law. <laughs> I'm a respected man when I got this badge on. When it's not. Boy, avoid that circus. <laughs> Mommy's boy. I'll send you a copy. Oh! Oh! Well, okay. Send you a copy. Bam! Bitch went down. <laughs> bitch went down. Dad? I don't think so. Take a message. No. Uh. I gotta say, she looks so good like that. Hello, Sydney. Even there, he's calling her? Leave me alone. Get get the police officer. Who are you? Don't worry. You'll find out soon enough. Does he reveal his identity every time he kills someone? Oh, is he got his gun? Shoot the telephone. That'll teach him. Billy was released. His cellular bill was clean. So how does it feel to be almost brutally butchered? Hey, hey, now leave her alone. What kind of question is that? How's your face, bitch? Want another one? Your mother's murder was last year's hottest court case. Somebody was gonna write a book about it. Right? That's why she hates her. Well, you nice well, sweetie. It's got said. Sorry I mangled your face. Wait, Sydney, don't go! Oh. Innocent man on death row. A killer still on the loose. Kenny, tell me I'm dreaming. That Netflix, come on. You should be working on this. Do you know what that could do for my book sales? <laughs> <laughs> Why is he loving that? Somebody was there. Hey, Chrissy, wait up. Some, someone tried to kill me. I know, me. I know. No, the cops said I scared him away. Couldn't have been me, I was in jail. Remember? Oh, that's very true. Also, he was in jail when that phone call happened. I have a girlfriend who would rather accuse me of being a psychopathic killer than touch me. <laughs> what? How did he come to that conclusion? I believe you're bringing this up. No, it's been a year. Tomorrow. You should be over her right now and touch me. How dare you? It's the way it is. She's not coming back. Not the same thing. Your mom left town. She's not. Okay, this guy is a psychopath, even if he's not the killer. Two of your fellow students. Just savagely. Not like the sound of those scissors. But your compassion and sensitivity, huh? Let me show you something. You're both expelled. Yeah. Oh, come on, Mr. Hembry. It was just a joke. That's not fair. It sounds pretty fair to me. Fairness would be to rip your insides out. Desensitize little shit that you are. Uh, maybe he's the murderer. Especially when he touched her face earlier on. For attention, the girl has some serious issues. Women. Oh my God. They just hate each other. Maybe she's a slut, just like her mother. You're evil. Please, it's a common fact. Why are women like this? I know I'm generalizing women like this, but it does happen a lot. You have to a bit. Okay, those are men's boots. Ah! Who did you get in this school? I did the toilet. This is known to be the same costume worn by the killer. How did you manage year old to get into the women's toilets and in the school? It must be a student. Gail Weathers, field correspondent, top story. I know who you are, Miss Weathers. Everything's under control. Well, of course, you're here. 
Oh, smooth. You know, in a demographic study, I proved to be most popular amongst males 11 to 24. I guess I just missed you. <laughs> oh, she's putting out the full charm trying to seduce him. Because my boyish good looks, muscle mass has increased my acceptance as a Sears police officer. <laughs> Police Department has issued a citywide curfew beginning at 9 o'clock tonight. No, serial killer is not really accurate. Gotta knock off a couple more to get that title. Well, we can hope, can't we? <laughs> Why is it joking about that? You are much prettier in person. So you do watch the show? I'm 25. I was 24 for a whole year. <laughs> Why am I kind of rooting for them? <laughs> Such a cute, adorable scene. Well, I don't know what you did, Sydney, but on behalf of the entire student body, we all say thank you! <laughs> Maybe the house. killer is a student, he's doing it just so they get time off class. Cool, you guys bring food, alright? <laughs> <laughs> a school house party? Prime for murder. Then he can get the official title of serial killer. Oh, come on, he was one of my favorite parts. That was a badass shot, though. It goes further back, Sid. You're starting to sound like some West Carpenter flick or something. Don't freak yourself. I love how they do keep mentioned in different horror movies inside this. He was creeping around the house. Watch it, jerk. Why is everyone so aggressive to each other? If you were the only suspect in a senseless bloodbath, would you be standing in the horror section? <laughs> this is standard horror movie stuff. Prom night revisited, man. Yeah. Is he gonna tell us the whole movie and lay out the blueprint? What, is she saving herself for you? Maybe. Now that Billy tried to mutilate her, do you think Sid would go out with me? <laughs> 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 no, I don't at all. No. His body will come popping up in the last reel somewhere. Eyes gouged out, fingers cut off, teeth knocked out. See the police. Yeah, he's seen too many films. <laughs> Everybody's a suspect. How do we know you're not? The yeah, I think it definitely is Billy now. Motives are incidental. Anyway. Actually, I'm thinking it's the other guy, because that smile is creepy. Are you telling me that's not a killer? He's a bull, he's a god. Look how wide the roads are in America. <laughs> it must be so nice. You have to squeeze in between cars. Right sure is quiet. The music this place going is off. Now I'm just gonna be a few minutes. You girls don't go too far. That's He's not gonna be in the shopping center, is he? It's no big deal, Sid. You thought He's in the ice cream section. His... No! <laughs> I was joking. I didn't think he came out during the day. Those calls are listed to Neil Prescott, Sydney's father. He made the calls with a cellular phone. It's been confirmed. Not picked up by morning, then we'll do a house to house. I also love this as well. It shows like the older cop smoking. Yeah, he's senior officer, and then the younger cop had got a light screen. <laughs> So the police officer's gonna be at the house party? That's uh, not awkward at all. Alright, girls have fun. Not too much fun. Though. I was about to say not have not don't have too much fun. <laughs> God damn it, they beat me to it. <laughs> Why would the newswoman turn up to a random kid's house party? I think so. Look at the camera. It's kind of crazy when you think about it though. There's a police officer outside the house party and the news ready in case someone gets murdered so they can film it live. Like keeping an eye on things. I'm gonna check the party out. Do you mind if I join you? Not at all. How about you check me out? Alright. She's gonna get the footage of the murder and put it all over the news. <laughs> Hey, grab another beer, would you? Hey, you am I the beer one? You're underage, son. I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm a good time. <laughs> He's the cool cop. What is she doing here? She's with me. I'm just checking. The He's so excited about it. I just think you're awesome. Oh, thank you very much. I watch your show religiously. It's great. Should I be worried? Yeah. Not yet. 
try and hopefully catch a glimpse of children get murdered. Ew, no, something's about to happen. Can't, man. Hey, shitheads! And he told her to go down there, so he might be in on it also. Just throw the bottles at him, throw them. It's the outfit, if Sydney sees it, she'll flip. Oh, you wanna play psycho killer? <laughs> no, please don't kill me, Mr. Ghostface. I wanna be in the sequel. Andy, what the hell are you doing? Not the alcohol, come on, anything but the alcohol. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck it. Yes. Ah. Okay. Ah. Trust in choice to escape. Ah. Just like snapped her neck in it. I'm guessing she's not in the sequel. Ah. Hey. Okay, that's very suspicious. Why did he come from around the back? No, it's okay. We do need to talk. Oh. Oh. Oh, shit. Blake. I got a delay. How long is it? I don't know. What'd it take you to walk from the house? 30 seconds? I can see how this might come into play. One great big movie. Is he trying to use like trauma to bring them together more after what happened to her, her mother? Why can't I be a Meg Ryan movie? <laughs> that can be arranged. Are you gonna get poor now? Oh, that's something bold to say. Here comes. Oh, yes! Yes! You guys are crazy. Breasts. I want to see Jamie Lee's breast win. Watch a musical. That's why she always outsmarted the killer in the big chase scene at the end. Only virgins can do that. Don't you know the rules? There are certain rules that one must abide by in order to successfully survive a horror movie. Big oh, nope. The dead man. Oh, Even impossible. God. Sex equals. What's he doing with the tongue all the time? Every opportunity he has, his tongue is out. Never, ever, ever under any circumstances say, I'll be right back. Because you won't be back. I'm getting another beer. You want one? I'll be right back. <laughs> <laughs> okay, he's definitely going to see that woman hanging there then. Somebody reported a car in the bushes down the road. I'm going to go check it out. Care to join me? I'd love to, if you're sure it's all right. Ma'am, I'm the deputy of this town. Oh, playing the law. You're not scared, are you? Is this him being romantic, their first date? Look! Here comes the obligatory tit shot. <laughs> yes! I love how they commentated on this while it's actually going on. Hello? They found Principal Henry dead. He was gutted and hung from the goalpost on the football field. Hey! They're not gonna hit them on the road. I don't think you're that bad. No. The cars are coming! Get out the way! Slow down! Freeze! Go! I didn't even try to stop. I'm sorry. Are you okay? Oh. Is that what you're looking for? It's Neil Prescott's car. Sydney's father? Yeah. Tommy didn't know where it was, but them jumping in the bush managed to find it. <laughs> I was just thinking if it were you, it'd be a very clever way to throw me off track. You know, using your one phone call to call me so that I wouldn't think it was you. It's all. What do I have to do to prove to you that I'm not a killer? Huh? Oh my god. Sydney. Billy, watch out! <laughs> She could have warned him better. <laughs> I like how he cleaned the knife. I can't tell if that was bad acting or he's playing it because the way the murderer just let him turn to him and go. <laughs> That's false. She's really good at blocking doors. That must be a superpower. She got super lucky there. It wasn't just like a spiked fence. 
Uh, watch out. Watch I wonder what movie they're actually watching. Leave in the comments below if you guys know. I told you. I told you, Spider. Oh, this guy's like one of my favorite Jimmy. people of the movie. Jimmy, look behind you. Look behind you. Turn around. I love he commentates over it. <laughs> Behind you! Look around. 30 second delay. He's already there. <laughs> Why would he crawl through there? Just go back the way he just came in. Call the sheriff for backup. Be careful. I'm okay with him going to the house because I know the guy's not in it. That's smart with the TV being on. <laughs> Should probably turn the TV off. Kenny! Useless cameraman had to go and get himself killed. Maybe you should have lost some weight while doing it. Gosh. Let's go! <laughs> ah! <laughs> Just beat him up with the telephone. To be fair, back in the day they were chunky units. <laughs> I'm sorry, but get off the window. Oh, she was so mean to him, even in death. No, not Dewey! He had a gun, and he was the best character. That's why he was so confident. Hello, he's gonna try and kill me. But he's good at vanishing. Shoot, it's me! I found him! She's dead! I think Stu now! It's him, it's him, because where did he come from? Please give me that gun! Give me that gun, guys! He did it! No, it was him. It was him. No, it was him. Oh, it was that guy over there. <laughs> He's still alive. <laughs> I swear to be like, nearly 20 minutes since we last saw him. Oh my God. Get help. No, he's out there. No, give me the gun. It's him. Look, he's completely fine. Stu's flipped out. He's gone mad. It is him. We all go a little mad sometimes. <laughs> Literally had this. Creepy version of Leonardo DiCaprio the whole time. But it stuff they use for pig's blood and carry. It's Matthew Willard as well because <laughs> Who stabbed him? Surprise, Sydney. What's the matter, Sydney? You look like you've seen a ghost. You die. <laughs> did they ever really decide why Hannibal Lecter liked to eat people? Don't think so. We did your mom a favor, Sid. That woman was a slut bag whore who flashed her shit all over town. Your mother was no Sharon Stone. Hmm? Your slut mother was fucking my father. She's the reason my mom moved out and abandoned me. That's the motive. Gave it up. Now you're no longer a virgin. <laughs> Dead virgin. Those are the rules. Now you gotta die. Those are the rules. <laughs> you're gonna love this. We got a surprise for you, Sydney. Be right back. <laughs> it's such a freak, but in like a cool, funny way. We killed her exactly one year ago today. <laughs> Kill her on a mother's murder anniversary. Now that's messed up. Oh, your daddy's the chief suspect. He cloned a cellular. Evidence is all right there, baby. We went on a murder spree killing everyone. Except for Billy and me. We were left for dead. They just in their bedroom just planned out what we're gonna do. Get up, man! Get up! Hey! <laughs> oh, they are. Ah! So they've also just injured themselves now, and she's completely fine. So she might have a hand heads heads up on them. And plan the sequel, cause let's face it, baby, these days you gotta have a. <laughs> That's very true. Team one, team many. No, Sid, don't you blame the movies? Movies don't create. Something. Blame the video games. I feel a woozy air. Yeah. Shouldn't they have done that at the end? God, man, the gun. I put her right there. <laughs> Right here, asshole. She's a badass. The reporter left for dead in the news van comes to. That'd be a good story if she ends up saving her. Okay. No! Works 
much better without the safety on. Gale Weather signing off. Baby, you're gonna love this. She's gone. <coughs> I don't know, Billy, but I'm hurt, man. Fuck. Alone in the house. <laughs> Rolls reverse. It's cold. Guess who just called the police and reported you? Sorry, motherfucking ass. I love the voice changing from her to the ghost face. The police are on their way. What are you gonna tell them? Peer pressure. <laughs> Sorry, ass. I My mom and dad are gonna be. <laughs> With an umbrella? Also, she put on the costume. <laughs> I was just so focused on the umbrella. In your dream. <laughs> I should have put the TV on it. I didn't realize those TVs were so lethal. Glad they don't sell them anymore. Fuck you! Say hello to your mother. That's a gnarly thing to say. <laughs> she saved her. I guess I remember the safety that time, you bastard. <laughs> this is the moment when the supposedly dead killer comes back to life for one last scare. <laughs> what a shot! Right in the forehead. Do we still live? Hi, this is Gail Weathers with an exclusive eyewitness account. I helped. That's a great Netflix documentary. Ended in a bloodbath that has rocked the world. That was Scream, the original. What a cool concept of a movie. First of all, I really enjoyed that. I thought the ghost face, the mask, and the costume was cool murderer outfit. <laughs> is that what you can say? Nowadays, it's very iconic, that ghost face silhouette. It would actually be interesting if they made a Scream that took place on Halloween. Everyone's dressed up as ghost-faced and they don't know which one it is. Just like how it was in the school and those kids running down the corridor scaring everyone. That was such a stupid idea. Why would you even do that? No surprise that you're gonna get expelled from school. But yes, this is a great horror movie and admittedly, I haven't seen many horror movies so I haven't got much to base off but i really enjoyed this the twist the turns i was the whole way i was like who is it gonna be and you suspect the main boyfriend he just had this creepy leonardo dicaprio with his hair down vibe thought maybe he's trying to scare her into sleeping with him but what you don't think throughout the whole movie is what if there was two of them that was quite unique because i don't think many horror films play on that having two murderers one setting it up one doing other things so I would kind of have to re-watch the movie again to see where, like, with the beginning phone call, like, was the one ghost face setting up Steve in the backyard while the other one was chasing her around the house and on the phone with her? So it would be actually really fascinating to see and try and come decide who was who ghost face and who actually did these certain murders. I will say the only fault of the movie was at the end. I don't know why they decided to stab each other before they fully completed their story that they wanted to do surely it would have been made more sense to murder her frame the dad get that all sorted then stab each other to try and make it look like they weren't in on it but for some reason they decided to stab each other first which gave the others an upper hand because matthew willard was was bleeding out the whole time and to drop a tv on his head that was brutal i didn't realize tvs would explode and electrocute him like that that was just wild to see but i hope you guys enjoyed this movie as much as i did if you want me to check out scream 2 or the other screams because obviously there's a franchise with like seven or eight different movies let me know in the comments below any cool facts stuff about this movie i'd love to hear what you guys got to say about these movies i'll catch you guys in my next video